The Hooters is under fire over new crotch string uniform shorts. Have you guys seen the new Hooters uniform? Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> is that a yes or a no? <clears throat> I've seen them, yes. I have not. They're a little scandalous. All right, so Hooters is under fire over new crotch string uniform shorts. Uh, Hooters employees are pushing back against new revealing uniforms that include shorts so short that they're like underwear. Do, do you want to see them real quick? They're just a little bit shorter than the, the original ones. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They kind of look like they look like back in the day too. I feel like they changed them before to the they're previous not ones. orange no more. And then back, yeah, they're back, not back then. Back then, them shoes used to be way up there, bro. The high waisted too. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> I remember for sure going with your dad, your high man, all them. But if you think about it, I mean, not every. Probably there's probably a, a few girls that don't fit, like fit the outfit as well as others. Like it's supposed to be Hooters, bro. You know Hooters are like boobs. That was right? that was something like the girls were saying like they were getting paid to be sexually harassed. This yeah, like I was gonna say Hooters. Um, was there any uh, history of Hooters being sued over employees? Uh, yeah, around in. I think it was uh, 2013, uh, a staffer was awarded $250,000 in, in a racial discrimination lawsuit. So <laughs> check, check this what? out. Ozzy. So a freaking uh, a Hooters, the, it's, they said they prohibit African-American Hooter girls from wearing blonde highlights in their hair. What? So this they chick, didn't this allow chick this. got terminated. Yeah, she got fired because she had blonde highlights in her hair. What the fuck? And she yeah, was back in 2013. Yeah. And she got she got paid out 250k. It's fired, man. <laughs> man but, uh, they, yeah, well, like, I guess, all right, the the chief and owner of of a bar and butcher place, and she was a former Hooters girl. She said, it is an entire job based on sexual harassment. You are paid to be sexually harassed and objectified. Everyone at Hooters is aware. <clears throat> See, I mean, and we understood that. We understand that. Like you, like as a guy, you understand that the, that's what happens. And uh, and I was telling Chris, I was like, but sometimes, you know, I mean, look at the OnlyFans chicks. They put their shit out there all the time. They put themselves out there. There are women or girls that out there that will wear the freaking uniforms because they'll think it increases their chance of getting better tips or uh, seating more people or something. Like people are gonna want to make money, and if this is what they got to do, I mean, friggin', uh, some of the captions on some of the girls posting their stuff was like, oh, I guess they're, the uniforms aren't that bad. Is is um, is this degrading? I guess you're like holding the girls to like a standard of what they have to wear in order for. I mean, I don't know. But if if guys. <clears throat> but it's not like their cheeks are out, you know. They're wearing leggings. Bro, they're stocking them. It's not a family restaurant. Hooters is by far yeah, from a family is, restaurant. Literally, it's for it's for it's it was made for guys, bro. Yeah. Or like, let, let, like, like let's say that there's like a magic mic thing, like a magic mic restaurant. There is. Yeah, there, there is one. Yeah. It's called Buff Chicks or something like that. Oh wow! Wait, hold on. What like, Buff Chicks? Oh uh, wait. Like it's yeah, guys. Yeah. Yeah, there's guy or really think, no, there's a I think buff chicks is actually buff women <laughs> that walk around, but uh right, that's what I would assume. No, yeah, there there's I think I seen one on like somewhere like a, on a internet or something that there was like a reverse hooters for guy like for women and it's like guy servers with like short shorts type shit as well. Yeah. It might just be um cause cause what I think about is like I'm sure guys will, will have to go through the same thing, but I'm sure women are like, 
we wouldn't know because it's not as big as Hooters. So mm-hmm. like it's just not fair to say that like Hooters got good food, bro. Yeah. I would Chris doesn't right believe there. that. Yeah, Chris don't believe that. That's hey, that's okay. He likes Playboy Cardi, <laughs> so it doesn't surprise me at all. <laughs> I think the only thing they have good, maybe they're oysters. I said the boom boom shrimp. The boom boom shrimp is pretty good. The the buffalo shrimp pretty good. I I, I told Frankie I'll, I'll like. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, you see, you see, you see, you see. You see? <laughs> I'll dip. Uh, I'll dip each Hooters. Oh, irrational each therapy, dog. Irrational <laughs> therapy. That's what we're doing. <laughs> oh shit! But, uh, no, I mean, change, not, you gotta change the name, bro. Not not every name, girl. Dog. Not every girl was hating it. Uh, some employees. We're defending their uniform on TikTok and share the enthusiasm with their new shorts, including one TikTok user who said she's making way more money since she started wearing a new uniform. And another who wrote uh, in the caption, am I the only hoodie that loves the new uniform? I like that. A hoodie. A hoodie. Um, but then again, Ooh. there are some girls that are hating. Uh, mm. One chick ended up saying, so... Hooters got some new panties. I mean, shorts. <coughs> wrote one TikTok user. I love my job, but I don't. I don't love wearing undies to work. Wrote another. Which I feel you, yo. Like sometimes I like free balling. Sometimes I don't. But you don't wear underwear to work. Yeah, that's what she said. I love my job, but I don't love wearing underwears to work. But no, nah, I, I don't know. I, I I think she work at? which one should work at? <laughs> <laughs> Tell her to go work at Cracker Bro then, where they have to wear pants. I, I was I was telling Frankie that like I look at these like uh like aerobics, like um chicks in gymnasiums and whatnot in the Olympics, they wear shit like this. Yeah, I like, mean it's yeah the summer volleyball, Chris. Like uh the women are out there in their bikinis playing volleyball, diving around and shit. Yeah, right. these movies are taking it too far, nigga. If you don't want to be a server there, go be a server somewhere else. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Go work at First Watch. You, yeah. <laughs> Literally, Shut anyone will hire you. But I mean, have you, but like, if you think about it, any wing place, they have, I mean, that have served, like, uh, I can think of three fucking uh, Wing House, Hooters, and uh, I mean, Twin, Twin Peaks. Peaks. Yeah. And they all have similar uniforms. I think Wing House House probably has the shorter shorts in the game. And I don't think they wear stockings underneath. Yeah, it looks like this chick has stockings on. Like she has, she definitely has something on. But um, she's also fucking got a dump truck attached to her waist. So (laughs) she don't fit in the goddamn uniform. And I ain't mad. Uh, My... We went out to Twin Peaks the, the like a few weeks ago, and a lot of the guys they're like, "Man, I don't know how they could work. I don't know how the chefs could work here, man. Like, I'll feel tempted every day." But I think ragers, nah, bro. I mean, I mean, nah, nah. Right, yeah. exactly. If it, like, if it's a spot like that, they're busy, ain't they? Yeah, bro. It ain't. It well, ain't, um, it, ain't it gets all like old that. after a while. That and it, I mean, it's like I said, you're not even focused on that shit, dog. Like at all. You're yeah. working, bro. You're working. No! You're there to work, nigga. Hey, 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 hey. I mean, but but I, but you you don't get those girls to be like like you just give them the or not you, but like you see like an employee be like, oh, he got some fries, girl, and then like they're like, oh, thank you. If I have old food, I give them to the service for sure at work. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's got to be sitting there for thirty minutes, twenty minutes. If I can't um, sell them though, then I right, I'll give it because I won't throw it away because why the fuck I want to throw it away. You know what I'm right. saying? I'd rather box it up and put it on their little table right there, and that's it. Mm. Label it and what that, it is, and they eat as they now come you know, back. Now you know women. They're going to be like, oh, you feeding other women? Oh, yeah, for free? Yeah. Probably silly, it's probably silly if she hears this. She's going to be like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> there were some waiters I mean, at, at, at the end of the day, dog, you know, to perform better, you got to nah, be yeah, full absolutely. of energy, bro. So, I mean, if they're doing good and they're fucking running food and, and the shit's that's not true. coming back fucked up and they're not ringing them bad tickets, why not fucking reward them with old food? You know what I'm saying? Right, right, mm-hmm. right, right. Because they have nah, to pay yeah. for it. All right. Yeah, they got to pay for their food, bro. And I think that's kind of fucked up. They're already making so little, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. They work off tips. I don't know. I've just been in the restaurant industry so long, so I feel for everybody in the rest. The rest. There was, 
there used to be this lady when uh, I was working at Oakenstone, and we'd be making pizzas for like some of the the servers, and uh, they'd be like, "Hey, can you make me a pizza?" And we'd be like, "Yeah," so that they don't have to pay for it. But there was this one lady. She uh, we we she was taking a, a pizza out to somebody that we made, and she goes, "So who do I bill this to?" And uh, the guy that made it, he's like, "Oh, it's on me. Don't worry about it." She goes, "Oh, well, I don't know how to do that." And uh, she's like, it's probably because I'm married. I don't get free stuff, huh? <laughs> <laughs> but like, that that's true. Like stuff like that. Like if we make a pizza, a salad, a, a dish or something, it doesn't get like taken or if it gets overlooked <laughs> or the people leave or something. Yeah, we give it to the servers or we leave it out back, like in the back uh, where we all like wait or shit. And some people will come and pick at it or something. I don't want to get married. RIP that job, that job though. I'll get married one day. Hey, Me and Frankie were hey. talking about it. Chris, everything worked out, bro. That's what's up. My daughter's marriage is coming soon. Hey, this might be. <laughs> hey, this might be coming soon, 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 soon. I know, I know, I know it was coming. Ozzy, you. Uh, so yeah, so y'all are still going to Hooters, right? Yeah, Ozzy, I'm going still- at, uh, at four o'clock today. Matter of fact, to watch the game. <laughs> You're, you're like, uh, taking that's what I'm doing uh, today. You're, you're still <laughs> taking <laughs> little Zeke. Hell yeah, I take. I'm, man, look, ask little Ozzy what he want to eat, nigga. He gonna say Hooters off rip, dog. What, what, what rip. would you would you feel comfortable taking your family to a men version of Hooters? Same food, but men. That goes Same back food. to. But that goes back to Ozzy talking about exposing his kids to stuff like that. <laughs> I mean, it's the same thing. It, do, yeah, but do you want to see a fucking frog eye in front of your face while you're trying to order yeah, a beer and a not, kid's because, meal? Because Celia don't mind, but I'd rather not see a fucking a, a fucking toad in my fucking peripherals though. And I'm trying to bite a fucking wing, like and he's gonna be like, right, okay, can you I know? get you anything? <laughs> I, I don't want to deal with that, bro. And, and, I hear you. And, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and I don't want Celia looking at other fucking. Niggas, Sally can look at women all day. She love looking at women, bro, and I'm okay with that. I bet you are. <laughs> she let me look too, so it's all good. I've been checking to see if it's okay, but hey, you see that girl's ass, right? Like, yeah, yeah. Is, but like, is, it, is it real? Yeah, girl, you see that? You see that? So, first, I, so, show her, I show her the ugly one first. Like, it, it's Why just double standards type shit. You know? Yeah, it's just double standards. <laughs> we just gotta live in double standards, kind of. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't give a fuck. That's it. That's it. That's OMG, all. nigga. OMG, yeah. I'm gonna fuck. OMG, that's it, bro. <laughs> OMG, all right, guys. Fuck. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, we had an, uh, a nice little break. I'm really glad that that we came back, came right back into action next week. Gonna be a little more adjustments. And uh, if, if y- y'all ain't tell, we still got the same intro. We still got the same this and that. So we're mainly focusing on content right now. So just stay with us uh share with all your friends help spread the message as much as possible but before we get out of here y'all got anything else to tell the people uh wash your motherfucking hands steel because y'all motherfucking steel dirty uh <laughs> go cowboys go go cowboys that's it, that's it. uh dolphins playing right now they up 13 and three yeah the yeah Jags. the Jags. Hey. Uh, it's, it's it's looking tough, bro, but it's going to take us forever to get above 500. <laughs> I don't even think and it's going it's to be possible, but... They scrap, they, like, they're like playing real scrappy right now. But anyways, wash your hands, wash your ass, all that bullshit, you know what I'm saying? Just keep it clean in between, you know what I mean? Oh, Check yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Be smooth, stay cool, you know what it is. It's your boy, your boy, your boy. <laughs> Have a good week, guys. All right, guys. Well, thank you all again for listening. We're going to catch you all next week. Peace in the Middle East. Let it rain in Spain. We out. Boom.